to know And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my thoughts keep telling me to let me out just let me How's it going lads, Marshall here and welcome to another Inform Analysis. Now today we are reviewing the second informed version of Juventus man Carlos Tevez and guys if you do want some coins to buy him visit HDFUT coins and use that code right there on the screen M89 for 5% off. Now he's going to cost you 300k on the Xbox One, 280k on the PlayStation 4 so he is not cheap in the slightest and as you're watching this the brand new Team of the Week has just been announced so list down below in the comments section who you want to see reviewed this week. Now he's got a 4 star skill move set, a 3 star week foot and some bloody amazing skill attributes. Look at the ball control, finishing, free kick accuracy, short passing, long shots, penalties, all bloody great and he's got 95 shot power to boot so all these skill attributes are bloody amazing but where Tevez is gonna slide downhill is with the work attributes. Well, the work rates. Work attributes, what the hell am I on about? It's high, high, and that does affect him massively in game because you want to know where your striker is at all times. And he's got 99 aggression. Yes, 99 aggression. I'll explain what that does mean in just a sec. After 42 minutes into his debut, he does this. 42 minutes? Nah, 42 seconds. I'm getting everything wrong today, but what a goal that was. I went bloody nuts when that went in the back of the net because. I'm just kicking off the first touch with Tevez, I get the ball, I do a little ball roll, drag back thing, I do a roulette and then I bang it. I don't know what's going to happen, flew in the back of the net. And just look at this as well, that is fantastic, great bend on at this strike, you'll see it on the replay as well. He gets it out of his feet and he just bends it like Beckham or bends it like Tevez, whatever you want to say. Now I'll get back to his aggression, what the aggression does is make you win 50-50s more often than not. The higher the aggression, the better chance you do have of winning 50-50s. And if your strength is very high as well, you will win them more often than not. Height does come into it as well. Tevez isn't the tallest in the world. He's not the strongest in the world. But the aggression make him act like a little bulldog nibbling at the heels of defenders. It's just hilarious. And it does mimic what he does in real life. So that is a pro. Another pro is he's finishing. You've seen some great finishes already very early on in this review. These are basically shots that didn't come off and he did assist that kind of he actually didn't get any official assist but when you do shoot like that you're creating chances for your teammates to tap home his long shots are fantastic you've seen it earlier in the video you're seeing some now that doesn't come off and he's just great at pinging them from range and his ball control it is inch perfect his cons positioning and that is because of his work rates I suggest you go play this guy in calm. Centre forward striker is not this guy's position. He's only going to get a 4 out of 5 star because of being a striker and having those work rates and the positioning that he does have. It's just not worth it. And that will be about it, lads. I hope you have enjoyed this review. Remember to drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. Catch you all next time.